What's up? I'm Callie, and I am backstage with Eric. Eric and Patrick. And Patrick. Now, from what I understand, gentlemen, Patrick, this is your venue, correct? This is my venue, this is my venue during Fashion Week. We basically take the empty space. It's a totally raw space, and we build it, and we have shows. And as you were telling me, whatever you want, he creates. Is that correct? For the most part. For the most part. You got to figure out how to actually make it happen. Okay. In time. <laughs> right, right. Time is always the pressing matter, right? Now, you gentlemen were telling me that you have 11 shows this week, right? And you weren't sure which number this was? <laughs> it's a lot. Fashion's Night Out is always a hard day, and it kind of throws your whole week off from oh. there. We did three shows in one day here. Okay. So, it's a lot. That is a, a lot. Now, what's the record for how many shows you've done in one day? I think in one venue, three is the records in the single venue. We had, a, we had 11 events in that one day. This run Fashion's Night Out. Wow. So besides the three here, we had shows all over the city, so it's a crazy day. Yeah, you gentlemen are busy, and you were telling me that for the show we just saw that how many people came today? We had about 575 or 550. Okay. And you said that they actually had to turn away a lot of people. About 300 that weren't on the list. Which is a lot of, <laughs> a lot of people, but I'm sure that they could find their way to somewhere else, right? Just not here. Now, what do you think is the coolest part about doing shows here in this venue? I love the rawness and I love contrasts of very pretty and very raw. So, okay. that's, that's what I like about the venue. Right. Very simple. I like that. Now, what's the most difficult thing that you've had to overcome creating for him? Uh, well, the thing is, we've been at Exit Art for the last six seasons. Six seasons yeah. So, working in the same venue over and over again, you get comfortable with the space. This is the, our first time in this immense space okay. uh, with a lot of challenges. The floor isn't even, the walls are different. It's The rawness is the biggest challenge, really. No running water, power everywhere. It's it's crazy. So, you really have to come in and like fit all the pieces in the right place. And uh, it's difficult. And with you know, 24 people who've also never seen the space, you just walk in and you're all like, whoa, okay, this is gonna take a long time. Right. So. And a long time, and you said all without running water, right? <laughs> no yeah. No running water, no bathrooms. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, but amazing porta potties. Amazing porta potties. So, what is the biggest thing you look forward to during Fashion Week? For you, you know, specific to your venue? I look forward to like having the beautiful shows and having the beautiful people coming in and just like, you know, the creation the creation and the finished products. That's what I enjoy. Sure. And you pretty much once it's all done, you can kind of sit back and watch the shows or are you still running around crazy? Yeah, no, there's never a dull moment. <laughs> okay. Especially with a show like this where you have, you know, five or six designers in one show and everything needs to be coordinated down right. like absolutely everything and sharing the same models with the girls and having the backstage ready and it's a lot of work coordinating the videos and the sound and the music the DJ for it's basically like having five shows simultaneously which is a lot <laughs> that is definitely a lot now so a lot going on right now the lot the rest of the week once it's all said and done what do you look forward to the most four days in fire islands <laughs> <laughs> Again, simple explanation. And what about you? No rest for me. I go right to building another performance venue in Midtown that I'm working on. Okay. Uh, it's going to be like an entirely projection map space, so like a sort of technical venue where you can come in and live in an environment and have an interactive sort of space. It's right. going to be something unique. The city doesn't have anything like it yet, so okay. it's quite challenging to build that. Very so. cool. So off to France for you and, and more building for you. <laughs> well, gentlemen, thank you so much for your time. Absolutely. Anything else you want to say? Hope to see you in another shows. Yes. Thank you so much, guys.